for what he's doing right now.
I believe in some traditions, some traditions are worth holding on to. But when your tradition gets in the way of God, All right. when your tradition restricts or restrains the moving of the Holy Ghost, the function of the Holy Ghost, the operating of the Holy Ghost, then that's a problem somewhere. Amen. So I'm so grateful to God. So grateful to God. And I want you to always be thankful for how God has blessed and how God is blessing this church. And don't take your church for granted. Don't, don't take your church for granted. Don't take your church for granted. Let us just continue to
West at seven. And let me just say to you that don't rally or take a Bible study. The Lord has blessed us tremendously in our teaching of the book of Ezra. I have learned a lot and I've been able to share a lot. If you haven't partaken of this particular teaching, get ready to probably the next couple of Wednesdays, not sure how long it's going to take. We're going to be soon through with that particular book, but there's just so much in there, and, and I would just encourage you to take part in Bible study. You're going to learn something. It's going to be a blessing to you. To musicians, choir, to all the personnel that help to Bless others through audio, video, and just to all, to all, to all, to all, to all. We thank you for you. As we get ready to go, God, we're so thankful for all you've done for us. So grateful, God, to experience your presence. Jesus' name. Church, amen. 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 